This is a smoke eliser device. The purpose of this device is to detect carbon monoxide on the breath. So carbon monoxide is the byproduct of burning anything organic. So burning tobacco in a cigarette will produce carbon monoxide, which is inhaled into the lungs. And carbon monoxide then sticks to the haemoglobin, which is the blood cell that normally carries oxygen around the body. Because the carbon monoxide binds permanently to these blood cells, it means that oxygen is not able to be carried around the body. Now that of course is harmful and we want to reduce the amount of carbon monoxide people are inhaling, particularly from cigarettes. So when we measure the carbon monoxide in the breath, it gives us an indication as to the amount of carbon monoxide that might be on the blood. And we use this meter to do that with a simple breath test that literally takes 15 seconds. So the way that this is used is the machine is turned on, a new straw is placed into the D piece. Now the D piece needs to be replaced every month. It does contain a filter so that it's always hygienic, but we replace it every month to make sure that the filter stays functional. A fresh straw is placed in, machine gets turned on. After the machine is turned on, we press the button, which then indicates that your patient needs to hold their breath. They hold their breath for 15 seconds. And once the counter counts down, you can actually give the, the machine to the patient to look at the time because they do tend to get a bit worried about holding their breath for that length of time. And then the machine tells them that they now need to blow through the straw emptying the air from their lungs. After this point, their measurement of carbon monoxide will show on the screen and it will show green, orange and red lights on the side, as well as a number with a percentage and a parts per million. Now a non-smoker should be reading less than 1.6% carbon monoxide and anyone who's exposed to secondhand smoke may read a little bit higher than this. And what we're looking for is obviously a reading in the green, which confirms that our patient is a non-smoker. The more heavily they smoke, the more carbon monoxide is going to be in their system. And of course then, the higher percentage of carbon monoxide um, will show up on the reading as well.